guys, what is happening? It's Output Ups everywhere. I have a awesome review on um, the Wacom Bamboo Pen Tablet. Um, this thing is a godsend and I absolutely love it. Um, so what this thing really is, is that it is it connects between your computer and pretty much a pen or your hand, it depends, they have like a pen and touch version. And what it is, is you can literally control anything on your computer screen um, with this thing. And this this kind of outline box, whoops, uh, this, one, this outline box right here is pretty much your entire computer screen. And so it's not like this pen so you can drag and drag and drag and drag to get to a certain spot on your screen. This entire thing is your screen. So if you can see, I'm going to this corner. You can see that on the screen it corresponds to the corner in the right side of my screen as well. If I can go down here, I can go to the dock. And it's very sensitive and it's very, very active and it's, ve it's pressure sensitive as well. And so this thing is pretty much, I think, what designers use when they're designing in Photoshop and what painters use when they're fixing up their pictures in Photoshop as well. Um, you can customize this thing so that on this pen that it comes with, this bottom, this there's two buttons, one here, one here. I set this one to scrolling so you can click it to scroll and this one has a right click and it becomes very, very handy, especially during in bouts of Photoshop. Um, this thing has revolutionized the way pretty much I use a mouse. I don't use this mouse anymore. I pretty much just use this because it's a really fluid, different way of controlling your computer and your movements on your computer screen. Uh, as you can see, it's very, very fluid and it, the, all the movements match perfectly um, to the movements on the pad, on the screen compared to the pad. Uh, you can see that there's really, there's nothing connecting this thing to here. Uh, and between five millimeters, I believe, between the pen and the pad, the computer will sense the movement. As you can see, I'm not touching it. I can move my finger under it, and it'll sense that I'm moving it. I'm not touching the pad. I'm touching the pad, but you can, the computer senses it, which is very, very nice. Um, as you can see, I have a picture here of a biker that I've actually been working on and try to make it, I'm trying to turn it into a, uh, a more drawing-esque type deal. I'm going to make a new Photoshop board right here and I can show you what exactly I can do with this pen. If I go into my pen tool, I can go to the brush, I'm already there. I can go to a different color, make it a dark gray, and I can go to my brushes, go to this one right here, make it a 7 point would be good. And I can show you that it is very pressure sensitive. You can see that I'm pushing no pressure, but a line is very, it's gradually getting drawn on. Whereas if I put lots of pressure, you can see that it's a very, very strong line, of course. And I can just keep on doing it, keep on doing it. And eventually it'll get really dark and I can do that. Um, and so there you go. It's, it's like, you know, very cool like that. And honestly, it's a really, really incredible way of controlling Photoshop and using Photoshop to its full advantage. I believe that you w you really do need this. Um, I've been using a mouse trying to edit my photos in Photoshop. It's not helpful. Not at all. Once you experience this Wacom tablet, it becomes a whole new way of doing stuff in Photoshop. For instance, I can make it just a really plain, simple, elegant tree right here. Just really quickly, I guess. That's not... I'm going to do uh, a new thing. And you can see this is pretty much a mouse, just it's using your hand and it's using a pen. And it's very, it's very, very intuitive and very, it brings you a lot closer to your computer screen. Um, and what, the movements between the pad and the computer screen just become so fluid together. Uh, there's a tiny learning curve to learning how to use this pen and this pad, but it's really nothing major. And I'm sure all of you who want to get this will be, understand, will be able to understand how to use this exactly. Uh, let's just draw a really quick tree. And it's really useful for painters in Photoshop as well um, to do this. This is a, such a terrible tree, I'm sorry. <laughs> but you get the idea. You can create really, really fluid, elegant movements with this pen. It just it feels just like a pen on wood, a pen would on paper. It's a very, very unique feeling using this pen instead of uh, a mouse. It's very, very different, and it's very, it's very, it's just, it's so, it's just a new experience that I've never really um, had before with my, with Photoshop, and it's, it's quite a fresh breath of air, I gotta say.
I do that, I can just change the pen. And so that's pretty much it. I mean, you can actually literally control anything you see fit with this pen. You can see that I'm not touching the pad, but I can go into my first class. I can go to here. I can scroll very easily. Like you see that this, the response time is very, very crisp and very, very quick. And I, and I absolutely love that. Um, and yeah, it's just, if you're looking for a way to control Photoshop and really edit your pictures in with a, a better way, you know, compared to a mouse, I would highly recommend checking this one out. It's seventy four dollars, sixty nine dollars, I believe, plus tax is like seventy four. Um, so it's quite a quite a deal. So I can take this Photoshop picture and really really smudge this out, like over here. Maybe increase the shadows in his leg. Of course, I'm still you know I'm still learning, so you gotta give me some credit here. I can go to a brush. Brush tool, go up here, go to pointer. You can see him darkening the shadows in his leg, making it more drawing like. And I already did this up here, so you can see what I've done up here. Um, and so yeah, that's pretty much it for this Wacom tablet. Um, there's no buttons on the actual thing. They do include the pen, this tablet, uh, installation CD, which you'll need, which gives you lots of tutorials on how to use this. This little thing right here, you can stick the pen in, and that's pretty much it. And for the seventy-four dollars, this is a, it's a, it's a really what an investment for me. I really, I'm glad I bought this uh, right now because now I get to experience how to actually use Photoshop to its fullest. Um, and it's a great, really, really great way to use Photoshop and really utilize all the features to find you find in Photoshop, like the new brushes and stuff like that. Um, so if you're looking into this, I would highly recommend it. Just take it from me. I love this thing. Uh, it's a new way. I don't really use my mouse anymore because I just use this because it's much more intuitive, much more close, much more personal. Um, it's pressure sensitive, so you know what you're doing. And it's overall a much better product than a standard mouse. Uh, so that's it for that. That's the bamboo pen uh, tablet pad thing for the computer. Uh, works with both PC and Windows, and so that's about it. That's my review on it. I would absolutely highly recommend it. It's what a revolution this thing has been for me. I'm not gonna show you guys like a good picture of a tree. I actually made a really good tree, but I that took a long time, and I don't know where that. But I'm working on this right now, and it'll hopefully turn out okay. I mean, I'm just trying to mess around with it, you know, guys. All right, so that's about it. It's iPod Ups everywhere. See you guys later. I've worked hard for this camera angle. Hope you enjoy this review. Peace.